Hey guys, welcome to a new unboxing review here. Shadow Collector here, AKA Jason. And I have a new unboxing slash review for you guys here. If you guys have been keeping up on a lot of the recent videos, I've been slowly but surely chiseling away at the NECA uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie line. I got a new one here, just came in from Makari. This is the Splinter and uh, Shredder two pack. Now there's a lot of variants of these figures that I kind of am starting to see out there now and I didn't really know where to go with which one, what makes sense the most. So uh, I just figured if it's a two pack, first of all, I can kind of save in space because instead of like two separate boxes, just one uh, kind of medium sized box, they kind of chisel them together. Uh, but two, I'm not really in particular on, you know, what the, I guess, the accessories they come with, because I think some of them are a little bit different than that. But again, this will work out for me, uh, this two pack here. Uh, now I just need to get like uh, April O'Neil is gonna be a little bit tougher one to find. Um, the other two Ninja Turtles, obviously I need as well. And then if I want any of the variants, we'll see. We'll, we'll get there when we get there. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm excited for this two pack. I got it for a really good deal on Macari. Uh, the box and everything that was, you know, in the photos was good, but I believe what happened with shipment, and as you can see here, uh, Splinter decided to try to punch through the box himself a little early there. Ow, ooh, that hurt. That hurt, that was sharp plastic. Uh, his nose kind of poked the box there. And I don't know if you guys can see it on this right here, but yeah, he um, kind of decided to poke his nose through there. So the box is kind of a little bit ruined there, but I'm out of box person. Don't plan on reselling these anytime soon. So ain't gonna matter to me. Um, I'm the type that if I can find these, actually these figures for a lot cheaper uh, without the box, then I'm all for it. Uh, there was one really good deal on like, I think it was a splinter and a uh, couple of shredders and Ninja Turtles for a really good price. And I hesitated on it and I thought, ah, I'll, I'll just wait out and see maybe a day or so. It was gone within like 30 minutes because it was such a good deal and I'm kicking myself for that one. <laughs> Let's unbox these guys here and uh, take a look. So as you guys can see here, Splinter looks really great. It looks just like out of the movie. Um, his jacket is like this actual like material. It's not plastic or anything, which is really cool. Uh, it comes with the uh, the ooze that, you know, basically, or the TCR, basically stuff that the Ninja Turtles became out of. And then he's got his little slippers you can put. He got different hands and everything, or you can give him some nunchucks. Uh, for Shredder, he does have his like baton weapon thing, uh, or you can put uh, different types of like claws on his hands, uh, slice up pizza as well. So we got Splinter out, we got Shredder out, they look great. Uh, we got slice of pizza, like I said, we got uh, several different hands for uh, Shredder. So again, you can have him with or without the claws. Uh, looks like we got him on here, one with the claw and one without. Uh, a lot of creepy, <laughs> A lot of creepy alien brown type looking hands for uh, Splinter. Like I said, and also you guys little flip flops here. Flip flops are probably just slip right on his feet. Or they're, yep, there we go. Probably makes him stand a little bit easier too that way. Yeah, there we go. We do also get a cape for uh, Shredder. So what's, there's only one way but to rip it open. Getting this material, which is nice. Like the NECA figure is very glistening and shiny. And uh, looks like he just kind of hooks around him, yeah. So we got his cape on and Shredder looks awesome. And he's got some wires kind of like in his cape too, which is nice so you can kind of, you know, fold it behind so you can kind of keep, you know, keep the cape on him kind of to the back and everything. But then you still can have all the, uh, you know, cool looking spikes and stuff. Cause that's, that's kind of the whole, I think what Shredder you need to have is all these like spikes and stuff, how cool it looks. But the facial and everything like that looks really good on this. NECA figures just never cease to disappoint. Um, the only thing I always see about this with some of these is that their feet are kind of like outward or inward awkwardly. So trying to get them to stand can be a bit of a challenge. Um, I'm a little scared about these two are very bendy. So I feel like if you put any pressure on him to try to get him uh, standing fine and everything. Shredder looks cool. Let's uh, and then Splinter's got you know, his little tail here, which I don't know how this is it bendy because it's like you can't really <laughs> can't really stand him up right because he's got the tail sticking out of him. So it's like I don't know if his tail can kind of. All right, so yeah, I don't his tail. 
Like I look underneath him here and it's like his 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 fur like and his tail like I I don't know. Again, I don't I feel like when I twist it it's gonna pop out. That's a little kinda hmm about this thing. I guess it just kinda sits back on it maybe you can Still stand okay? Well, I, I, uh, these things, I mean, I, I, I hate it because these are the most detailed figures you can get from this, this thing, you know, this, this movie and all that. And they, they just don't make them plausible to display unless you want to have them, you can't even sit on it either. Cause let me know if you guys are in the comment section, can provide me this, can this tail pop out okay? Or, I mean, I think it comes out. I don't know if it does. And I don't want to break it. Does the tail come out? Or not? It comes out. Okay. Well, that solves that problem. <laughs> there you have it, guys. We are slowly but surely getting into this line here. Um, you know, chipping away at it. Okay, that solves that problem. Now we got a leftover tail. <laughs> uh, let me know in the comments below uh, what you guys think of these uh, these turtle NECA figures. Let me know which ones you're interested in in the NECA line in general. I know they just announced the next wave of them that are coming out from NECA for the second movie uh, as like a four pack and then some additional single pack. So that should be exciting to look forward to and more money out of my pocket. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you for watching this video. And as always, take care. I'll see you next week.